records show that for 500 years, a cup, thought to be the Holy Grail, was kept in the Church of the Holy Sepulchre, Jerusalem. Then, in 909 AD, it disappeared from history. Now, an astonishing discovery may have solved the mystery. Spanish historian Margarita Torres came to this controversial conclusion in 2014, when she chanced upon a medieval text hidden in a library in Egypt. We have uh, this section, 16. Written in Arabic, in this document refers to an event 150 years after the cup disappears from the Church of the Holy Sepulchre. Here we have the first document found in Cairo. It is written in parchment. There is one line that stands out. Here is said, the cup that the Christians call the cup of the Messiah. This is the first possible reference to the cup of Christ after 909 AD. The text tells the story of a Muslim entourage giving the cup to a king in Spain. The King of Leon, Ferdinand the Great. But why would the cup be in Muslim hands? Rising tension between Christians and Muslims in 11th century Jerusalem led to the looting of churches and the chance for sacred relics to fall into Muslim possession. The looting was phenomenal, but it, it went hand in hand with an enormous persecution of Christians in Palestine at the beginning of the 11th century. But if the cup was looted, why would it then be handed to a Christian king in Spain? In 1055, Spain is divided. Muslims rule the south and Christians the north. Leon is the most powerful Christian kingdom. And its king, Ferdinand, is looking to push south into Muslim kingdoms. The document reveals that a Muslim ruler of Denia in the south of Spain, gave the cup of Christ to King Ferdinand in a bid to prevent any possible invasion. Evidence suggests King Ferdinand believed this cup to be the genuine grail and that it was only covered in gold after arriving in Leon in 1055. 